Okay, you guys talked me into it. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back, everybody, to some more Resident Evil 5 with yours truly, Free Wada, with the exclamation point or the added emphasis. I talked myself into, uh, with the help of you guys indiscriminately, um, you guys have helped me want to continue this just a little bit further. Just one more mission for today. It's been a while, so I, but I apologize for my, uh, ooh. I apologize if my throat starts catching up. What the hell happened here? But we're trying to get as many of these done today. I'm feeling good in the Resident Evil section right now. Uh oh. Excella, what's going on? Why? When I've done so much, all for you. Uh oh. Chris. How nice of you to join us. Wesker. Wesker. Don't worry. Your mission is at its end. Ouroboros is on the eve of its appearance. Six uh -oh. billion cries of agony will burn a new balance. Sorry, Wesker, but not on my watch. Albert! You said we'd change this world together! Oh, why? I thought they were partners. Wesker doesn't give a damn about anybody but himself. Roots. Chris knows. Even you will understand, Chris. One glimpse of my new world, and it will all make perfect sense. Show yourself! Unfortunately, it's too late for you. You <laughs> will not live to see the dawn. So evil. Sorry, Excella, but it appears Uroboros has rejected you. Though you have been an excellent asset, I have one last task for you. Uh oh. Albert! What the hell? Farewell, <clears throat> old friend. She's taken all of these bodies with her, too. It's not just one body, this is a conglomerate now of bodies. And that's what they were talking about when the regenerative virus starts trying to get every room of essence we can. Uh oh. <laughs> it's like we, it's like our fight with Irving almost here. Just a little extra. Just a little extra. So the first thing you do is, you gotta get ready to hit buttons. I could die a lot at this, so I apologize. Oh! <laughs> yep. There's the first one. That's the first one. I hit A instead of rapidly pressing X, because, uh, this game just does that to you. You gotta really remember the sequences. I don't think it even changes. Nice dodge. They give you a very short amount of time, too. Climb over. Oh, we're doing it. We're doing it. You really got to pay attention when it's done, though. You don't want to just keep spamming right after. This way. This way. We did it. Whew. They're not super difficult. Persistent son of a bitch. But you just gotta be ready as so quick what? as possible. Do you think our weapons can hurt that thing? Oh. I was getting ready to switch my weapons. It's tearing through the ship! We can't stay here! Wait, you gotta come, come pick this up. Tim, I want you to come pick this up real quick. We can't go in through that way. That's a that thing. Actually, there's this here. Handgun, can't use that. Silver chalice, or gold chalice, we can use that though. Duck on that. Kick through here. Check out what's in these lockers real quick. Oh, is that rifle? <laughs> I guess we'll make a 
make Sheva pick that up for now. She got a landmine. Oh, there was another locker here. No. Oh. Oh wait, that's handgun ammo. I thought that was uh, okay. magnum ammo. Shotgun shells, nice. My God. Look at I saw you trying to snag me. So this is not just Excella, this is literally everything mixed with Excella. They're giving us plenty of opportunities to work through here. And get lots of rewards, it looks like. It almost seems like there's a boss fight coming up, but I can't tell if they're being serious or not. Can't pick up that herb. That's blocking our way. Gotta go around here. Lots of bodies. You grab it. Okay. Grab that Machine gun ammo. Look at that headshot skill. Here we go. Did we meet one of these? Flash them. You're done, though. Bridge key card. Right under a point where she could have attacked us. Go around here real quick. Let's see if there's anything. Nope. Just that. Just some goops. Automatic navigation's been engaged. I can't operate it. Report on Project W, August 28th, 1998. It has been confirmed that the accident at the Raccoon City Arclay Research Facility was due to the involvement of Project W test subject number 13, hereafter referred to as Albert. His death in the accident made, has made obtaining any further information an impossibility. Albert's death was confirmed by the Information Department. Albert's death puts the current success rate of Project W down to 18%. Quota of qualified individuals for the project has been drastically reduced and must be addressed immediately. This poses a grave situation for any progress that we can hope to be made in the project. Since there is no roster of qualified individuals to replace the recent losses, it would be advisable to start selecting individuals from the pool of failed candidates. After this, adjustments can be made that will restore up to 93% of the quota prior to Albert's death. Umbrella Information Department, Alex W. Well, <clears throat> they would be happy to know that he is not dead. Spencer's no bug. I just received word that Raccoon City has been wiped out. The Americans finally took action against us. I hope the irony of using the very military machine that was supposed to protect them from foreign attackers to kill their own people is not a loss on them. While the danger posed by the threat of the T-Virus spreading was very real, I don't think Americans will easily forgive their own their government for the deaths of over 100,000 of their own people. If the truth of this matter is ever brought to light, support for the current administration will plummet. I don't think he wants that. Even a child can see that they will come after Umbrella with everything they have. To hide their own foolish mistakes, they will blame Umbrella for Raccoon City's annihilation. It will be Umbrella... It would seem Umbrella would share uh, Raccoon City's fate, but perhaps it will be to a lesser degree. Umbrella was nothing but a tool for a research of the progenitor virus. Even without that tool, the research only still survives. Only Umbrella's lowly employees will be hurt by this dissolution. If the secret research involving the progenitor virus is protected, then I can always rebuild anew. I've always, I've already made preparations for such a plan. <clears throat> the research facility in Africa remains a secret, and it is there that the progenitor virus is produced. Something that we didn't achieve until the late 80s. Only a handful of people in the company are even aware of the African facility's existence thanks to our strict regulation of the flow of information. Only a minimum amount of personnel were ever transferred from Africa to other locations and they were always closely monitored. Director Bailey has been confined to the African facility for almost 30 years and even that has all been for this day. All that remains is to close that facility and everything will go according to my plan. Once that facility is gone, all its connections to Umbrella will disappear with it. Then I will have to deal with anyone who has a level 10 security clearance as they are the only ones who know of the African facility's existence. Everyone else will be summarily disposed of. My secrets will be protected. When one buries a treasure, one should not leave a map behind. For now, stuck inside the notebook. Personal with access to company secrets. Oswell S. Deceased. Henning P. In prison. Asaki T. Deceased. Jenny K. Whereabouts unknown. Carlos M. Carlos found. Information obtained. Eliminated. <clears throat> Brandon B. Deceased. Frank E. Isabella C. Greg A. Lee D. Michael K. Ethan W. 
all deceased. Use our key card. The bridge. Let's see what's around here first. Make sure there's nothing around these corners. <clears throat> A little bit of handgun ammo for our partner over here. Partner in crime, Sheva. Emergency code. Yes, that's why it's locked. Or emergency mode is why it's locked. All the controls seem to be working order, but it won't let me operate them. Machine gun ammo. That's all you, Sheva. Grab this shoddy ammo ourselves. Can't lock. I can't do anything. It's locked. This thing is gigantic. We have to take it out before it destroys the ship. Got one more note. Satellite laser Shango operating manual. The Shango satellite laser is operated by using a rocket launcher style laser targeted device, LTD. That sends targeting coordinates to the satellite. The satellite is then capable of firing a highly concentrated laser to within centimeters of the target. Operation procedures aim the LTD at the target to relay the coordinates to the satellite. Two, once the target has been ascertained, the coordinates will be relayed. During the transmission, the target ring will appear red on the targeting scope. Note, if the targeting sensor's AI perceives that the target is no longer being tracked by the targeting scope, transmission of the coordinates will be cancelled. When lock-on appears in the scope, it means the transmission has, begun su has been successfully sent. Pulling the trigger will now activate the laser. Firing cam must be given time to recharge before it can be we just might have a recharged. The targeting devices on the roof. Before it can be fired Come again. <laughs> it must be recharged before it can be fired, not recharged before it's recharged. Alright. It is boss time, but first, first, you grab we'll make it. our partner pick up that. We are going to take out our machine gun instead here. Because <clears throat> I'm guessing a shotgun is not going to work too well here. Actually, with the double upgrade, it may be okay on the spread. Here she is, though. Excella. Excella on steroids. To use the key card here. It's all on you, Chris. I've got your back. Boom. All right, one down. Watch out! It's firing off some sort of projectile. Charging. Let's get up here now. Still got a little bit on the charging up here. Boom! Uh oh, watch out for the projectiles again. <clears throat> I think you can do this without the uh, laser, it's just really easy with the laser. And it allows you to uh, actually. Just do whatever you want. You just gotta run around instead. Oh gosh. Come on, come on, let me. So maybe we do set this down for now. Or we could shoot one. Yeah, it's got a bunch of them now. Chris, above you. Yes, I know. I know. We'll take one here. We'll let it recharge. Uh-oh. Yeah, they hit us. What? What? Okay. All right. All right. I see you, game. I see you, game. You grab it. Roger. So we should probably just shoot these things first, then get the laser going on. That Let's go ahead and hit huge. that card. Do you really think it's no, 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 no. Oh, uh, why would they put a ladder right next to this thing? I 
now I'm trying to use the key card, Sheva. Shoo! Got one. Little projectiles. Oh. Let's jump down here. Uh, we get hit by that real quick. Dig pieces out now. Time to laser. It's all on you, Chris. I've got your back. Let's go ahead and get this thing. Not that, not that. Come on. Okay. I owe you one. Wait. What? Ah. Thanks, partner. Guess I gave her some grenades or something. <laughs> over that one real quick. Or duck under that one. Nice. Okay. Other one down. Machinay. Grenade days. These last couple pot shots on this guy here. Reload up on this. There we go. There we go. LTD here. Any extra ammo here? Oh, 
Let her pick that up. Pick this up. Oh, we missed. Dock that. This grenade launcher may come in handy finally. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Let's stabilize again. There we go. No, no, no. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We set it right too close to the edge. No. There we go. Woo. We did it. Did die twice. Enemies routed only only nine. It's okay. We did our best. We did our best. Oh. And we will uh we'll take a pause here. Thank you guys so much. That was a cool, that was a crazy boss battle. She never gets easier. Never gets easier, that's for sure. We got a red herb. We got that mixed up. We'll remove that. We'll remove this proximity bomb. We'll uh, give those flame rounds to us. We'll remove that. I think we remove these flash grenades now that if I remember correctly. Well, uh, she can give that to us. We can combine that here. Give that to us as well. She'll have a ton of spaces left. Fill up her ammo. Jailbreak her shoddy. We do have some shoddy ammo at least now. I have some of these extra flame rounds up here. What we can actually do is mine this instead. Piece there. Give that to Sheva. Give that to Sheva, and we'll take a pause here. So I want to thank you guys so much for watching. So much. If you liked the episode, feel free to leave that like, comment, or juicy subscribe. You know I'll take whatever I can get, baby. And I'll see all y'all in the next episode. We're really close to finishing now, so it's getting there. Bye!